Hi and welcome. I'm Chris Principe, the publisher of Financial IT. I'm here at Cybos, the great SWIFT event, and this year we're in Beijing, China. Beijing, China, for the first time, SWIFT has brought Cybos here. And it's important because Beijing is not only the capital, it's the financial capital, it's the business capital of China. Truly one of the countries that are leading the world in so many areas and here SWIFT has Cybos for 2024. So with that, and all that excitement that goes with it, I have my good friend David from Broadridge joining us so he can tell us a little bit about Broadridge. Thank you very much. Great, my pleasure. Great to be here. Thanks, Chris. Uh, I'm, I'm here in my new role as the, uh, the President of Asia Pacific. Uh, it's brand new to have uh, a single head for the Asia Pacific region, so that makes this Cybos really my inaugural event uh, in this role. And having it here in Beijing is really, really interesting for me because uh, it's the first time being held in, in China, and it is one of the most interesting and potentially enigmatic markets in the world for financial Very services. True. Broadridge is a company that is absolutely at the center of, of the trading life cycle, and we enable our customers to transform and innovate and, and essentially drive more business and new business in their trading uh, areas. Uh, and that's very important in a, in a very strongly uh, retail market such as, such as China. Um, we have traditionally uh, entered the China market via Hong Kong. Hong Kong is still the gateway to China, and in fact you could argue it's becoming more important in that role as you move ahead. And that makes this location of Cybos really interesting for me. While I've been here, I have heard uh, an awful lot of discussion about the future of the Chinese market, inbound, outbound, what's going on with the global capabilities of Chinese firms. Really, really interesting, right where Broadridge wants to play with our customers. So this is a fantastic experience for me. Well, you know, first, congratulations on your new role. Thank you. What a challenging role. Oh, yes. First, bringing everything together. Second, the uniqueness of the market. So how do you approach this? In your position, you really have to have the big picture, but still make sure everything else is working together. Yeah, the, uh, the Asia market is not one contiguous market. There's not one regulator. There's not one government. There are many pieces to it, and each part of the market is at a different position in its digitization, in its, in its technology, in the way the market responds to, to various products. And the business culture is radically different across the Asia-Pac region as well. So that means that we have to be very careful at prioritizing and strategizing how we move ahead in this market. The opportunity is huge. We have to make sure that we spend our time in the right place. Well, you know, it's, it's interesting for me because I've seen the, the growth of your company. It's been pretty spectacular over the years and quite a challenge to be able to keep that going. And it seems like you're positioned really well here in Asia for that. I think so. I think there's two things. One is we're already in the market. We're, we're in the major financial centers and we're in the market with customers who are actually succeeding. And that means that we have the track record. And, and as you know, Asia is a relationship market. Trust is super important. And that's where Broadridge, I think, is in a very unique position. Obviously, I feel no stress given the expectation, but I think that we've positioned ourselves very well for this. Yeah, no, it cer certainly is uh, going to be an interesting market and a big challenge. And part of that challenge I always see is, is how do you bring technology and business together and then bring it to not only the great customer base of banks you have, but to add to that customer base. Yeah. And the, and the important thing in Asia is you must try and meet your customers where they expect to be met. Right? They expect to be met in their local environment, often in their local language, and they expect that a, a, a firm such as Broadridge is able to understand exactly their unique priorities. If we're able to do that, we will be successful in this market. Well, you know, it's interesting as you talk about the need to be where they're met, and I also agree, that's very true, which leads me into, we're here at Cybos. Broadridge has decided to come to Cybos bring staff, bring people, why Cybos? Well, the, the obvious answer is because everyone else is here, <laughs> right? What do the bank robbers say? I rob the bank because that's where the money is. So that, that's not untrue in this case. However, 
This is quite unique in that there is much more of a domestic uh, focus on a lot of the interactions here in Cybos. Other Cybosses are more global in their view, more international. This one, because of its location, has turned out to be quite focused on China. I've had the most interesting conversations about this market here in the last day and a half than, than I imagined I would have. So it's, it's turned out to be a very unique event. You know, it's, it's interesting that uh, Cybos very much is about bringing together their existing customers and more importantly, I think, the, the financial software providers to them. Because the banks need help, they need good companies to be able to do that. And there's so much that is happening and changing, it's hard for the banks to keep up. David, what do you see going forward in the future? Well, you know, obviously everyone will tell you that oh, regulatory change, that market change, market growth. China has gone through an interesting market challenge in the last two years, actually through the COVID period. I don't see those things changing. The pace, the pace of regulatory change may actually increase. Look at things like T plus one in trading. These things are going to impact here just like everywhere else in the world. So the very same challenges that our customers have already solved elsewhere in the world will need to be solved here. So I, I see uh, increasing uh, pace of change, but also increasing opportunity for firms such as Broadridge. Okay, great. Well, David, I really appreciate you taking some time. Congratulations Thank you. and best of success for your new Thank position. You. Very challenging. Yep. And welcome to Cybos. Have a great Cybos. Thank you. To you and your team. Chris Principe, Financial Exit.